Hey guys, welcome to another episode of 234 Essential. My name remains Ayomiri Tayo AOT2. And my course is here. Um, and I'm Uguchi the Evil Stallion. Hey guys. Yes, yes, yes. Happy Valentine's Day, you guys. You are going to listen to this like a day late, but I'm sure in the spirit of Valentine, Valentine doesn't end until Sunday. So uh happy Valentine's Since Day, guys. Valentine's what do you say? Since when does Valentine end on Sunday? Uh, because if falls no, this is the rule. If it falls during the week, you have to stretch it to the weekend. Mm-hmm. It's normal. It's ah, normal. Okay. Yes, ma. Yes, ma. So people so, do not go to have time today now. So they will wait for is Friday, like Saturday, your... Sunday. It's what not do you mean? true. Everybody has time. I said uh, today. Okay. I didn't sleep lately until we until I went outside and I see cars. I and dispatch I, riders. Like, no, they've been working overtime today. Everybody's a lot of dispatch companies. A lot of companies have apologized that sorry, your order cannot go through today. That is tomorrow that you must receive it. A lot of relationships are on fire right now. What do you mean? (laughs) Because they're sweating it today. (laughs) You get that's like you mean you didn't send anything from for Valentine's guy. You go explain, 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 no evidence. You go explain. You go to explain. Yeah. Oh, well, happy Valentine's Day, guys. We hope you guys have a lovely. You had a lovely day with chocolate and money uh-huh. bouquet. And we're talking to the ladies because we know men in this part of the world, men know they receive. We know, I never see anybody we don't one man we don't show say he didn't receive anything. So let's see. That's the one you will not see. You yeah. will not see. I got a cupcake today, Sha. So that's okay. Wow. The, un- now, the truth is, is now the office truth give is us now. office office hey. office calm down calm but down. you but you you collect gift have you no collect gift that is the office gift oh so that's oh no, no no i don't like this no be, segment. no be as the parents you, for the office no be as the parents you, for the office you now you define business for the office where the parents who they pay the rent for the office no, they, no, it's like a it's like a workstation so we rented the space there and the workstation gave us a cake, small cupcake. Oh, the people so, that uh, own the people that own the building. Yes. And I was really thoughtful of them. Yeah, so it's not like say no, yeah, anything. Just no man. Now money now. Is our money in your hand that I use it to pay mm-hmm. this thing? Now. Question, to buy the cupcake. question did they give you the did, did you receive gift or you didn't receive gift? I received. I'm not one of the unfortunate men in Lagos who are being used by women. So I received, yes. Hey. All yes. this labeling, say unfortunate and being used in the lot of unfortunate men that have not, yes, now they did not receive anything upon all the old money bouquet, everything, everything. I'm Maybe sure, not I'm, sure that that, I'm sure there are ladies that did their thing for their man. So those are married, those are people, those are married people, and those are people in their 30s. Cool. There ain't no woman in the 20s, you know, no young woman in her 20s is going to be giving man a gift. It's not possible, sorry, sir. But guess what, right. I forgive people in their twenties, especially now mm. that I'm in, my, I'm in my thirties. Yeah, because you really just be trying out different things. You know, by the time you get into your thirties, you 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 sort of have a sense of some le- some sense of direction. You know what I mean? So for, I mean, if you're, anyone who's dating a baby in her twenties and she didn't get you anything, or a guy in his twenties and he didn't get you anything, don't worry. You know, talk about it. You guys should talk through it. So it will come. <laughs> Mm. I don't know why you they you they do thank this God thing like because they get Thank God the days of my madness have disappeared. I've been cu- I've been partially cured by the people in Yabale, so I'm okay. I'm fine. I remember before when I gave a lady. Ma- so I remember when I gave a lady a bag, and guess what she gave me in return? Tell me. Small chops. I think that's so cute. She they say you the waste man's heart uh, is through it's not, stomach. Uh, it's through cholesterol. I know. I know. No, no. No, the only thing. Why you did? You are not speaking this thing. I, I think is, I think you deserve love in your life because you didn't speak this thing so much. Uh uh-uh. uh mm. No, no. So they take talk calm. They say okay. it was, the way to have that is true. His stomach. Now you okay. say my cholesterol. Okay. Have you gone back to the gym, Ayo? I've not gone back. Please, first of all, I have things. I want to go and repair my gym. My gym is the most paramount now because my gen, I'm never repairing the gen. I'm buying a new gen because that gen has lived a good life. Nigeria has killed What's that generator. What's what is wrong gen? Where's and tears of you know generators were not built to come to Nigeria. I hope you know. 
I have no idea. There, I didn't know that. There is no generator manufacturer in the world that says, let's build a gen for a country that never has light. It is it is just oh. generators are meant to be backups. But in Nigeria, right. they are the main source of power supply. And that's why your gens Excellent. don't last. That's why after one year like this, oh, they're not, they're, they're coffee. They're they are coffee. They are already coffee. So man, man has reached the last level he wants to be now. So let me just get five months to go and buy gen. Uh-huh. Um, well, see, gen money now is blood money. Yes, so I have some people it. received. I have some people receive generators because that is the biggest love language. Love uh, any biggest gesture you can collect. This well, is Valentine. I think you should call. You, you should name your spec for generator so that just in case uh, anybody uh, is uh, 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 they give you small two point five kV collector like that too. No, they do long throw too. And so, and you don't know, you know they talk the one way they do you now. Say two point five kV. Some people will not even they want me cano. They want me cano now. Noiseless. Okay. Yes, now. You know, go loose treasury. Now, you know, say you go loose treasury. You know, get okay, hard to put your meter. Okay. Okay. It's too ghetto, please. Mm. What the hell? I you hear know, you. We get that struggle because my generator too is bad. So they said the AVR is bad and the AVR no. is killing brush or Finish. something like that. See, they don't. Basically, begin and end of the story. Say they don't knock me one bill like this. That bill is almost forty thousand. In fact, it's more than forty k plus workmanship. Oh wow! To just fix the gen. Hey, I see how much I buy this gen. Where I won't use them over forty k to fix them. But anyway, mm. Sham, the guy finally fixed it today. But still, on still. No worries. I mean, next three months again, something go happen. God forbid. See, my generator don't used to give me problem normally because I don't use it all the time. I don't like yeah, the sound of generators. Nobody, likes, on, nobody right? likes the sound of generators, but I hate it a lot. you have to do it. You have to do it. Yeah. Me, anybody wants to sow seed, I just use a seed of inverter for me. Inverter, well, two batteries. Oh, there are capable men out there. There are capable men out there. Yeah, um, 100%. Uh, I say yeah. happy Valentine. I say happy Ash Wednesday. Not everybody, not everybody, it's, not, it's not everybody that celebrates Ash Wednesday. I hope you know. No, but, but Christians, but Christians commemorate the day from because they go to enter Lent now. Don't all Christians do Lent? So it's not by force. It's not by force. If you want to do, do. No, no. But like, do they? Do, is it not something that all Christians observe? Like Lent. Yeah, you observe, but yeah, 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 yeah. You do, sir. I want to ask you a question. Do you start the fast uh-huh. on Ash Wednesday or the day after Ash Wednesday? So to we start the, the fast on Ash Wednesday. Oh. Um so typically um some people I, I don't know I don't I I can't remember my catechism clearly, but um I know that on Wednesday and Friday you're not supposed to eat meat, right? And mm-hmm. throughout yeah. the season, but also you should be fasting and fasting doesn't only have to mean that you're fasting for abstaining from food. As the country being now, some people know their job self so that one says not really mean anything. You know, mean anything. <laughs> so you don't only have to fast from food. You can fast from things that you consistently do. Um, okay. Say, for instance, you're, you're always binge watching something on Netflix and that's your thing. You can fast from it. You don't need to do that. Do you get what I mean? So like that sort of fast, um, you, 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 you discipline yourself for the next 40 days. Mm. Um, yeah, it's strange. And after 40 the, days, Christ, Christ is risen. And we're the reason happy I'm asking again. is because I went to one pop, popular eatery and I saw somebody with ash on her forehead and she was eating. So I was wondering, mm. maybe one doesn't start. Maybe one is starting tomorrow. Did you not I, just, eat? I wasn't fast watching. I just noticed. I wasn't fast watching. I wasn't judging her. Okay. I'm just. Of course. You know. The place Side is close to your hospital. It was close, close to your hospital. Maybe she's eating for medicine. So I don't know. <laughs> she so, has to eat now. Or maybe she okay. don't def- what time of the day was it? This was around 10 a.m. Ah. Uh, so again, she might not be fasting from food. She may be fasting okay. from maybe giving up something else for Easter. Okay, or okay. All right. Father. We're making sure. We're just making sure. We're just making sure. All right. Now what for you? Be like saying your own go streaks. Anyway, you don't already say you'll be dictator before because before, ah, yeah, no get time. Hmm. Best in no chop again. Mm-hmm. Anyway. My favorite time. Yeah, actually, to be honest. Oh, for real? Okay, that's Yeah, cool. I, I really love Easter. I love Lent and I love Easter. It's my favorite holiday. Um, to be very honest, nobody should kill me, but I prefer it to Christmas 
a lot. Oh, so real. Yeah. Christmas where they go, oh, yeah. Christmas clothes. All right. Yeah, yo. Uh-huh. So I don't even think it's about the the uh, celebration around Christmas, right? It's more so um the season of Lent for me is like you is this it's like it's a journey, right? And it really just grounds you. Like everybody feels that um when we talk about when you talk about God, he lives such a when you talk about Jesus, he lives such a great life, you know, but even while he was amongst his, the people he came to save, they hated him so much that they killed him, you know. And so it just really gives you that deep, sober reflection where you have to then think about, so, like, why am I bothered if anybody likes me or doesn't like me? I mean, or what am I, all this giddy, 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 what they do? For what? The end, the end is death. Whether mm. I would like it or not, and it might not be great. Do you understand? You, you might not have a great death. Everybody wants to sleep, die in their sleep or something, but it might not just happen. No, walk, that way. I will walk with the Lord, or a chariot of fire will take me because I don't want to I love it. I don't deserve an idea like this. Praise chariot of fire. The, I will just say, I, you, He walks with the Lord. He just walk out. You don't see him again. He's giving princely vibes, heavenly mm-hmm. prince. Yeah. Now, well, <laughs> anyway, from your lips, yeah. Amen. Anyway, thank you guys for listening to the last episode. Raise up, raise up. If you've not listened to I it, please go ha- go ahead and listen to it. If you're a first-time listener, then two, three, four essential is that podcast that helps you break down the Nigerian experience. It helps you navigate life in this great country of ours that is growing greater by the day. Let's just put it that way. Because yeah, yeah, we are fasting. Yes, so let me let me abstain from negativity on concerning exactly. Nigeria. Exactly. That's it. Had. Because the topics we have today okay. is neg- are negative topics. So, uh, <laughs> yes. Just um, try. If you want to send us fan mail, you can send us fan mail at 234essential.com. And also for release therapy, and, you can send it to that same address. And follow us on every social media platform at 234essential podcast. Please, please. Yes. Thanks, Uncle. Yes. Now, we do know that you guys have sent fan mail and also sent release therapy for this one. But there was a but, and the but is that somebody is enjoying Valentine. You won't mention his name. The guilty person. He the next episode, you come and tell us what happened during Valentine's Day and whether exactly. we start buying serial we start buying serial like a pampas for him because things have crossed oh, the God. market. Uh-huh. We'll, be so we'll be expecting a new addition by November. Yes, so he has been he's withholding uh, uh, he has he has returned all our all our bills <laughs> and release therapy but for that notice. I have to tell Actually you. Called. Oh, you called him. I called him. He did not pick. Yeah. Like, he can't be picking. He's picking something else. Forget that one. I love yeah. it. If you know how many, if you know how many uh, mattresses are going to suffer this night. <laughs> oh Lord. Some people will Listen. see heaven tonight. See, to be honest, I'm actually spending the night at the hotel because um my oh. house is very. Very oh, same, for me right same now. thing, same thing actually, because the heat that caught me last night. <laughs> I could Listen. not sleep. <laughs> hey. it's, it's I so was tossing and turning. I was like, no, 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 no. Me, I did not sleep in my house, so ah, uh, I'm big. Pumping machine is I, not even working. You guys, I'm having an adulthood crisis. Uh, Generator is loose. bad. Pumping not working. Do you understand? <laughs> I'm just like out of it. I'm not even trying to suffer that kind of suffer right uh, now. No. Today, I looked at my bank account and said, if I die, I die. I can't stop finding this. I'm sorry. I can't die. Period. I'm sorry. Oh, Do you understand? the money finish, we go hustle another one. I'm tired. I'm just tired. Oh, God. You ah. only live once. Plus See. the heat in Lagos. You know I normally work from home. But this week, uh, exactly. outside the go office, I want to enjoy industrial AC. You know AC where they roof. <laughs> where they roof. Where your chest will be pinning you because the cold has entered your chest. That's what I want. Because oh it's bloody. God. It's bloody. We'll I talk about the heat imagine. later on. Yeah, we'll talk about the heat of later on. So, since we do not have uh, any fan mail and uh, release therapy, you guys should just save all your Valentine's shenanigans for us next week. You know, people that I'm don't... People that, were, people that didn't send you presents, people that send you presents and chocolates, let us know. The girls that dumped exactly. you on Valentine's Day... Your girlfriend that did not pick her call on Valentine's Day and she told you she slept. She had a deep sleep. Twelve hours sleep the next day. But uh, she slept. It uh, was of a course. tiring day. Uh, of course. Uh, uh, I know. Baby, you sleep well, for you 12 know. hours. Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My, My brother. Yeah. My brother, you are single. 
you my brother, in. you are single in Christ. That's and girls, if he's telling you that he's too busy, that's why he's not seeing you today, or any delivery company is not delivering your gifts, baby girl, you're single. But no, if you go on Instagram, there are a lot of delivery companies who are apologizing seriously that we cannot no. deliver anymore. <laughs> That he could have definitely planned better. Let me tell you, oh. I just went I went to Cold Stone this evening, right? Because mm. cravings. And one guy was just buying the cake that he wants to use and balloon that he wants to send to the babe that he's, he's hey, trying it's to... It's not bad now. It's still 24 hours. It's still 424 hours now. Yeah, I do not say that it's bad. I'm saying that he gets some people we know just even bother to put effort. I, to be honest, that guy A for effort, right? Yeah, Whether he's late in the night or anything. But the thoughts that count. Nah, that shit is just very <laughs> well. Fair point. Fair point. I don't uh, want to drag it because this is a yeah. season of love. Yes. Uh -huh. so I lost. No I lost. Uh, and see, major lost. Ladies and gentlemen, if you know you are going to be having coitus, chest to chest coitus this night or any other time during this Valentine <laughs> period, please strap <laughs> up. You don't just strap up. Plan B is there. Postino is there. Everything is there. Medical science has advanced, so please, because you will buy pampas, and you not if you tell me to come and raise money for you, I will not raise, because when you are ejaculating, you did not call me to come and ejaculate too. Sorry. <laughs> Let everybody be responsible for this. This is the word the Lord has sent to me in this hour. Everybody should be responsible for his ejaculation. Don't come and exactly. bring your ejaculation to my doorstep. I did not partake ah. in your adultery or fornication. Therefore, I should not partake in the consequence. Thank you very much. I love it. And yes. if you have used your money, if you have borrowed money from any any of these money lenders and you are you have used it to buy Palatine gifts, and now you're looking for somebody that's going to save you, please, dear, there is no savior. Your savior has come and he has died and he has So please don't stress anybody, you understand. Yes. Carry your love and your borrowed funds. Because one when you are carrying that girl with big bum bum, you need like you do not call me. You, you do not call me. Uh -huh. But so the bum bum is say. important. Uh, Follow big booty I'm, girls. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> but when the largest now finally comes, to, when you when the roost comes home, uh -huh. when the uh -huh. eyes. Uh -huh. Yes, don't come and involve me, please. I'll come to your naming ceremony and eat all the free food that is there. Thank you very much. I think we're hating on Valentine's, Sha. Look here. I think that's what single people do. That is what single people do now. They hate on Valentine's. Today, today, to be honest, I had a Galentine's. I woke up at I was I was at Lagos Continental for pre-Valentine. And I oh, woke no. up happy. I had breakfast with, with my friend. We had such a great time. We exchanged gifts. It was it was amazing. Make I know like make I know like say this year is not is not is good this year for me. True true talk. Of course, it was mixed with a lot of work. Um, we have a project coming up tomorrow Thursday, when the um episode will be dropping. Um, yeah. and so a lot of our efforts have been geared towards that. Um, also you know, and it, because it's also in line with our International Women's Day kini that we're planning. So that's much it, right? Yes, March eighth, exactly. Yeah, yeah, I'm dropping a video that day for like International Women's Day or something like that. Uh, what are you talking about? I think I'm picking on one of the like the f I think it's like a female artist. I can't remember the female artist, but I know it's that day I'm dropping something. Sir. Oh, I know what I'm okay. dropping. Yeah, I remember. I remember. It's a very great one. It's a great one. Don't worry. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You people love it. Mother's International. Also, there's for Mother's Day. There's there's for Mother's Day too. There's International Women's Day also. I, I love it. It's, it's giving yeah. planning ahead. Uh, um, uh, we have to we have to so important really really speaking of uh, like, hating on sorry speaking of hating on valentine's day um uh, x of the week and this tweet has gone viral around the world it has gotten over millions of impressions as a matter of fact 3.2 million views right now wow as we are, yeah and this guy tweeted this on the feb on february 8th you're already thinking ahead six days before Valentine because this is a man like me. He doesn't want rubbish. He doesn't tolerate hey. rubbish. And the tweet goes thus. February 14th. Please let your tweets be short because no be you start love. Just tell I us see. your name, your partner's name, and what the Lord has done for you. And you know what I like? Yeah. Just like yeah. no grief for everybody this year that everybody yeah. agreed that this is the motto. 
everybody yeah. agreed with this format and people were tweeting in this format yeah, hello right. my name is my partner's name is i see what the lord has done for us and go we don't want any fertility no no thread no long paragraph yeah. if you do anything we report you we will report your account and it will be taken down because nobody invents love calm down for jesus what christ you, the, the vigor yeah, isn't to say this thing like this even myself i don't fear Yes, All because there better, of this, there are better things to do, please. Not to have to be doing uh, the thing they say you they you, you they told the day where you go celebrate Valentine and me go loud down for you. I'll tell everybody that <laughs> I will put it on you'll be Valentine embarrassed. Valentine's a pagan holiday. We do not celebrate so much. Thank you. Oh my god. So at work, I mean, I know that I have not mentioned this on, on 234, but I mean I posted it. Follow me on social media, you know. Um, I currently have a nine to five with Marie Claire Nigeria. Um, as <laughs> fancy, I know, fancy. Right? as business, ah, as a business, as a business development and sales executive at Marie Claire, and someone on our team because we did this like really cute Valentine's video, you know, talking about what we want or we want to do for Valentine's. And someone on my team has very similar sentiments to what you just said, and I uh, God bless low key or I feel like eh? maybe your spec. So eh, we'll talk maybe after. you guys. Yes. We'll talk she after. Says she we'll said she said once she has a boo, that like she does. She's going to calm down. Like she's going to op- open herself to Valentine. So maybe this might just be the 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 broken piece, the lost. Piece. I just have I just have a very this pertinent question. Out. Very very pertinent question. Light or dark oh, skin? Me, That's light or dark skin. Light skin. Okay, light don't skin. worry. You. We'll, we'll talk after that. We'll talk after the recording. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah, no. We'll Ronnie. We'll talk after the recording. Love it. Love yeah, that love is the way you should behave. You cannot just be <laughs> flinging, flinging your, your love life on everybody. Oh, he's leading to my DM. I ignored him for three months. But he said, Mm-mm, sister, sister, this is an African Magic Plus. Just do as the Follow format the says. Format. Follow the format. Let's agree. Let us agree, please. Oh, Let us not. Your rowdiness is not a fruit of the spirit. It is not a fruit of the oh spirit. My please. Obey, very true. Obey. Obey, please. Thank you. Spirits. Yes. It's <laughs> like people who it's like people they give microphone to in church. Please testimony. And they now start 40, 40 years ago in our village. No, there was a full moon. So, mama, mama, please tell us in two lines what the Lord has done for you. If you hear your gonorrhea, <laughs> don't say hit me your gonorrhea. Don't be telling us all the story that we don't want you to do, please. But ah. see, the story, the story is important to the journey. No, like that's how you see, it tires me. Or they give you the microphone, you start singing. Hey, Madam, you are not the choir. They said, <laughs> give your testimony. Give your testimony. I know a church they just tell you, please just write your testimony, and the pastor will do this for you. Thank you. Summarize it. That's the are best you way. Yes, that's so fucking wild. Some people just Pastor overdo it. Or some See, people I have a very yeah. question. Yeah. For people who join NLP prayers in the morning, oh, right? Lord. I'm in a group where they drop the link every, sing- every single day. And it's all this old, where this old student association group, which are never yeah. good for anything. Apart from just Why old... Those morning prayers sometimes, sometimes it gets as they be personal. First of all, when I first saw NSPDPDP, I saw which, which, uh, yeah. which, uh, what's the name of that thing again? Which pyramid scheme? Which new pyramid scheme is this one? Right? Yeah. Which new pyramid scheme is this? Before I knew it was Christian, this was like, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, see, okay, and those also people who listen to Pastor MSPPD. Now, those two people, what's the name of the pastor? What's the name of the pastor? Which one? MSPPD? Uh, Pastor Jerry. Uh, okay. First, what does this sound like see, a political party, first of all? MSPPD. Uh, listen, that's what I actually thought that you were going to <laughs> see at first. I thought it was a political party at some point, too. <laughs> but mm. my real main question is this. Those heap of papers that he puts in front of those pastors in the morning... Is it testimony that is all those things? So I've never watched all, anything, so I don't even know. But I guess maybe it's prayer request. Ah, it's high. It's like up to almost chest level. Ah, on what prayer high. place? People, they ask for, people need many things in this country. People are going through a lot. Hmm. Ah, no, 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 no. They are going, no, we're going through so much. Really, yeah, really, yeah. really. 
We are going to be no, not in this country. But I need a genuine but, answer to that question. I really I ask myself all the time when I see that was this paper going? What did they really occur for you? ask and please if you are listening and you and you attend NS NSPDP APC, please let us know uh, what is it <laughs> Labour Party. What that is the name? NS... MSPPD. Yeah, NSPP, uh, NSPPD. If you attend, <laughs> let us know what those packs, stack of papers are for. Maybe this donation, yeah. though, maybe it's prayer request, or maybe it's testimony. Uh -huh. All I know is that I, if they give you the microphone, please, two minutes, say your testimony and go. Please. This is not the time to speak to Mama and Keji. This is not the time to sing special number. Not the time to you do seven to. hallelujahs. Please move on. Thank you. See, but how you know when God does something big for you, you can't just open your mouth. Wow, just say it. You oh, need to you. show him gratitude, dance, you know, sing. This is our services Tell end up. This our services end up. This is our services end up closing at four 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 p.m. I've been to churches like that. I know what I'm saying. There are churches that service finish four p.m. because people are just no. Ah no, I beg. Yo. Please, see, modern I Christianity. See, first of all, big shout out to the Catholic Church. I mean, they always keep their masses very short and sweet. One hour, 13 minutes, everybody don't come much because we don't know everything they do to your many hours. But yeah, for people who stay in church all day, especially on Sunday, ah, more grace to your elbows and may your, your prayers be answered because it can never be me. From I, don't, to I don't see why a church service should go beyond 12 o'clock. I do not see why. Midday, ba? Midday, everybody should be going home. What are you preaching? Definitely, see, the disciples are preaching everything you want to preach in this world. There's nothing. Yeah, the best preaching is in the Bible. There's nothing you want to say. You just want to give us as matters. You want to show us suits and iPad. No. Nothing see, again. Dude. and some swaggy stuff. Uh, no, no, sir. Yeah. Uh, Daddy there, G there's some, there's some, then, but yeah, Daddy G, always need to tell your congregation because now you don't one, you too. One now, one now. It's one now we're preaching. You think me and I be at six o'clock? Mm -hmm. What am I? Am I to be Joshua? Ah, no, I'm sorry. I, this, this, this is um, this by April before years of two, three, four. Till now, I never come one CBIC fellowship. Because you're not the, on? you're not the target audience. This is for men who are dealing with. <laughs> Uh, sexual immorality. Do you are you a man dealing? Have you have you transitioned? Have you transitioned into a man dealing with sexual immorality? No, these are for no, men dealing like, with sexual I immorality. Think, I, I feel I believe that you can. It should not be an absolute. The word is for all now. Uh, don't worry. When we have mommy Jill, mommy Jill open our own. Mommy Jill open our own service. Okay, you don't finally get mommy Jill. I said when we have mommy Jill, it's like when Pastor oh. Kawa do do Kawa's life. A husband will do for mm. my, for men. She will do for yeah. women. Uh -huh. okay, yeah, so. Everybody get down calling. Uh -huh. Hey, Madro. Fair <laughs> point, Shab. But I get you. I see, I see the legacy you're trying to create here. Thank you very and much. I support Thank you very you. much. Thank you very but much. But please, based off of association, I, like, I want to, personally, I would like to attend one of the services just to also, you know, be under the anointing of the words that you're going to okay. put out. We have dress code, though. We have dress code for women because we do not want I men see. to be distracted. I say, and no worry, no stress okay. yourself. I did it. No, just no let me artif no artificial hair. I know that me, I'm on low cut, I'm a body, okay. so that's no good. tight hugging dress. Don't worry, I don't get boo boo. You know, yes, okay. I don't be anti now. No makeup. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I see, I, but you know, I don't wear makeup. Like, okay. my natural state No jewelry of any makeup. sort, including waist bead, anklets, <laughs> uh, multiple pressing, <laughs> tattooing. Uh -huh. We cannot allow Jezebelian <laughs> spirits to enter the office. It's your own phone. It's your own phone. It's your own phone. If any church does that, you know, they get female congregation they get for this Lagos. So. I'm sorry. But everybody's out. Maybe they're going to go deeper life. Or MFM. See, well, nobody will go. When I they won't go to all those fancy churches. So, eh? hmm. No, I see. When I went to go and do my passport, that's how they say I should remove all my earrings from my piercing. I say, how now? How? Those how will I very, remove it? Those men are very rude. They don't give a fuck. But see, thankfully, majority of the people there were men. 
And I told him mm. that, please, I had this. Can I help me start rolling all the this thing out? He said, ah, we cannot do it. So I said, okay, I, I, me too, I cannot remove it. My nails do not let me. Then I had my nails fixed. The Shasha left me with my piercings and I took a pic I took the picture. So oh, that's nice. That's that's the testimony in itself. Yeah. In I know if you tint your hair. Climate. I know if you tint your hair, they'll tell you Mr. Man, go and move that yes, color so. one time. One time. Yeah, they will let you. Yeah. They also, yes, no tinted hair in our <laughs> church. You must use the color they the Lord like... gave you. Thank you very much. Now in our church, now obviously, now no one to if we don't want forward, do no want forward progression. It's static. We want progression. We don't want Jezebels. There, yeah, that's the thing. We don't want dispute of Jezebels. <laughs> the halls of Babylon. We do not want them in the premises. Thank you very much. You need to check. You would. need to check your morality really, really because. Oh, we sent to the lake of fire. We do not want those uh, kind of women at all. I don't already did the lake. Went small. Uh -uh. Yes, now. How? Now, they brought, now they put the petrol for the lake now. They are judgmental in your in this kind of CBIC now. Well, it's it's, right. great, it's interesting that people still want to even join. I will but not be hearing is, about it. Is a is a very is a an underground movement. We don't. It's like the Fight Club. We don't tell people. It's just don't worry. It's very underground. Got it. Yes. Hmm. Love it. I I like that secrecy. Mm. A brotherhood. Mm -hmm. Against <laughs> fornication and sexual morality, please. <laughs> it must be said. I to be a lecturer for to make I no lie. What do you say? You actually, I said to be a lecturer to lecture will fit you. I can't be lecturer. I don't have the patience. I'll kill somebody's child. I don't think so. Uh, I'll say, so I please tell that. me what you don't understand in board mass now. It is simple bracket of division manipulation. Uh, additional subtraction. Additional so subtraction. why, what is wrong with your brain that you don't understand this now? Did I don't I don't feel I feel like you you would actually patiently teach you. It's yeah, just that yeah. you can be you might just be you might be giving some nonchalant vibes, but yeah. Which is nice. I feel like you are patient enough to teach. Okay. <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, but Osage can definitely be a lecturer. Oh yeah, he'll be a lecturer. Definitely. A strict one. That one definite. That one they show. Ah, when Osage wants to tell you something, I'm is very restricting up to you say see data, the data he'll be giving you so that you too you will not be able to argue. You say no, Ugochi, that's not yes, definitely a lecturer for sure. Lecturer material. <laughs> definitely. I agree. Are you I playing agree. music? It's my phone that's doing somehow. Uh, I'm watching people's that, what's I'm watching people's Valentine's shenanigans on um, Snapchat. But I hope people really had fun this Valentine's of 2024. It's a business. Like, they do not have fun. <laughs> See, the parking lot downstairs is full. There's nowhere to do. They said, like, on the island, everywhere is, everywhere is booked. Oh, God. There are no hotel rooms. Mm -hmm. I call the hotel. I know. Fornication. I call, the, Fornication. I call the hotel. I called the hotel two day like two days ago. I want to call the name. I'm tempted to call the name, but like I'll just let it go. And they told me that they are fully booked till Friday. That mm. Friday they're not even sure I should check back in. This is one of the big hotels on the island. And guess what? Not Friday. If you slack, if you slack, by the time you reach there, they don't book everything for weekend. I'm so I'm so certain it's actually fully it's going to be fully booked for the weekend. I'm certain. Obviously, no. Uh -uh. When way. somebody when somebody yeah. has like seven girlfriends or somebody has like four boyfriends, you go you go timetable the thing. But see, this Lagos is wild, Sha. God, I beg everybody stay safe out there. It's a madhouse. If you like don't stay safe, it's HIV is real. Madhouse. You just take you take antiretroviral drugs. You don't eat cheap well. well. You, you, will, you, you will live long. That's you will be like Magic Johnson. Thing. You will live long. That's actually the responsible thing. But why is everybody so frenzied about living long though? What do you want ah. to stay for so long to do? I want to be like eh? me To do what now? That's what I'm I'm certain that he probably I'm I'm certain. That his life was a little boring because who else no. was alive with you? Have you read have you read, Testament? have you read the testament? What testament was popping? Okay. No, see, I'm saying that 
it was born like brown slept with his house girl did you hear that gist oh oh my god you're gonna give old ancient of this story ancient stories where nobody nobody else is live has lived that long with him i'm i feel like no i feel it will actually be a very boring life loki to be honest it won't be boring to them because there's nothing it's not the it's nothing they can there's no there's no other life they could compare to it they were the most modern most progressive mm. latest happening guys yeah, it's weird that are looking back at it and like that life would have been boring but back then or um, more party upon party ah uh, okay should say the party that time uh if you go if you went to what's the other place that god destroyed Sodom and gomorrah that was mm. definitely I feel yeah, one, yeah, yeah, yeah. one of the yeah. people that escaped from Sodom and Gomorrah, his descendants mm-hmm. made it to Lagos, and that is why Lagos is the way it is. Exactly. One of the descendants of Sodom and Gomorrah found his way to Lagos, and you know, this is why Lagos is the way I, it is. Wow, how you came up with that right now? Because I'm not C- CBIC, CBIC, international, it's definitely a conspiracy theory that I yeah. have never ever imagined. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I uh, I think we've not even caught up on our week. Oh, how's that going? Oh, how's your week? We've not caught oh. up on our week. Oh, yeah, that's true. Week. What happened during the week for me? Oh, uh, nothing much. Uh, we're watching Super Eagles. Uh-huh. Super Eagles lost, you know, unfortunately. So uh, yeah. You know, basically, all work throughout dealing with the heat, you know, no lights, uh-huh. dealing with Nigeria. And all I'm that we basically yeah, went out a couple of nights, you know. It's scary. Okay. Yeah, in Lagos now. Where will again the light go out? Mm. No, I said I was like, okay, like I'm agreeing. Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. In mainland. It's scary the num the the age, every age of girls out there hustling. Let me just put it out there. It's scary the age, like bro, is is it's that's a different word entirely, you know. Um, How you longer there? Max 22, 23. Mm. Yeah. And like, bro, shout out to you guys. God help you. See. Yeah. So that's how my week went. Nothing much. I don't think I left mm-hmm. out any important bits. Nothing can get happened. Just normal life. Mm-hmm. How was your own week? Ah, uh, my week has been eventful. Um... Of course, I watched the games. I also went to Terra Culture to see a stage play called Sometime in May. Fully, really fully island body now. Even like you went to Terra Culture, <laughs> Intercontinental. Hey! <laughs> we got to watch you. Please do this for me. <laughs> so let me, let me tell you the, tr- the thing. Eh? It's just because I am very lazy when it comes to talking or posting about certain things, right? But, like, I'm always, this is definitely my vibe. Art exhibitions, going to see stage plays, going for dinner. Th- that's definitely my vibe. It's just that as a human being like this, I don't know. It's just, it's not something that. It's, it's <laughs> this I'm is just. Full not see, you no, know, but I've been have, I, I had such a great week. I'm not even going to lie. And I deserve it because. Prior to now, I you know how it's been. Anyway, I've been having major um, anxiety, panic attacks, and been really, really anxious. But like these past few days have been really good. I'm really grateful for them. Cool, um, cool. Yeah, I working hard, getting some positive feedback on the projects I'm working on. Yeah. Um. Haven't locked in certain things, but hopeful for that. Um. What? It was a sad. It was a sad. Oh, I also went to watch Polo. Um. Visit hey. Polo Lagos. Jesus uh, Christ! You know the people that go to the people who go to watch Polo are like the one percent of the one percent. It's like it's not. Uh, it's not there. I don't think now. I yeah, think. No, I never even watch uh, Lagos United SF. I mean, Lagos SF. I, I never okay. even see If you can be on the Polo. island on, if you can be on the island on Friday, let's go now. Let's go and okay, watch I should together. Be, I should be. I should be on the island on Friday. Okay, let me know. Let me know towards like like I think we're going towards evening. I, I have an extra ticket, so we can. I know, Allah. My camera, my camera will work ready. 
aesthetic. God, I beg. Lagos, big boy aesthetics. But- Call me, oh, call me, I beg. Of course, I'll call you now. I'll do, I will just, okay. ah, 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 obviously now. Come on. Yeah, now let's do it. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Many times, when I, many times, I realize that when I go out, it's mostly because of work. But these days, I'm trying to be more intentional. I'm doing things because I want to do it. Yeah. Um, and it was when I was watching Polo, then I heard that we, we got the sad news about what had happened to... Oh, um, yeah, the tycoon. CEO, yeah, of Access Holdings, um, yeah. Mr. Herbert Mig. Really sad news. I thought they were joking. Like when I was, I was hearing mumbles, like we, I was hearing his name a lot in people's conversations. I was just like, ah, you know, say me, I know they did social media, so the way they hear everything last. So they were just talking, mumbling, mumbling, and I was like, mm, what's going on? When they called his name, I was like, Mm-mm, that's a lie. Uh uh-uh, uh, Herbert K. Okay. We we just hear yesterday say they do school show me see and sad 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 um it was sad news for me, for us to well for me to, I actually woke up the next morning and I burst out into tears because truly truly what does it really profit like what's all this struggle in this life for yeah. just to lose you know just to lose your life at the end of the day you know it was a really reflective time for me and really really sad news as well um i've been opportunity to meet uh, mr herbert a couple of times and really really gracious a man he was it was such sad news um and i know that in one way or the other he has also touched the lives of many nigerians you know because i mean but the banks have been the um, highest um employers of labor for the longest and you know a lot of people had had to go through access bank under his leadership you know and i don't know that's really sad news for me um and i'm sure for the whole continent really um but yeah it was it's been a good week i've been learning to be intentional about myself doing what i like what i love just so that i feel better I think better, I'm functioning better, um, and I'm hopeful for um, things to come, really. Oh, yeah, that's nice. and true. Yeah, so oh, that, that's cool. that was basically my week. Oh, um, I forgot. Oh, continue, continue. Oh, and I got a haircut, so oh, new nice. haircut hoodie. Oh, shit. I know, I like when I cut my hair. It really oh. it changes my life. It feels very All revolutionary. Right. <laughs> when I didn't oh. tell you, no, not so. And when I don't tell us, same as you guys, don't even listen to uh, cutting your hair is actually great. It's not me advocating, but personal preference. I don't think anytime in the near future I'll be growing my hair anytime soon, man. Because wow. what? Wow, so easy. I promise wow. you, uh uh-uh. uh, it is the it is so freeing. Oh, now when I go cut my hair, where I watch the first match between Nigeria, that's when I watch my first Afghan game, um, wow. Nigeria South Africa. Oh, I'm a piano. Where we won, I'm a piano. I took it over. Okay, I was First of all, it. Nigerians are badly behaved because after that match, <laughs> social media was. Oh my lord. Agog. See, mm. if South Africans carry guns, started shooting us, I won't blame them because it was too much. <laughs> I don't know whose school was. I don't know whose school it was, but the male school, male lost them. <laughs> These guys came out of singing Tyler's Water. Oh, make me swear. Make me swear. I'm like, God have mercy. Yeah, what? Like... what is this? Yeah. Yeah. I love it. One thing I forgot to yeah. mention was that I read four books so far this year. And I'll, be, I'll uh-huh. soon be wrapping up in my fifth one. Yeah. Press our neck. Yeah, yeah now you know, with it. <laughs> if, you, if, you read, if you read like 60 minutes a day, then you should be able to finish like two books in a month, or even three or four. Say. See, you know, I was I was telling some piece of this thing you just said. Now I was having a conversation yeah. with a friend, and he was talking about um, he was talk- somebody. So someone something had happened at some point with, between between myself and somebody, and the person was talking about being neurodivergent, and mm. the person, my friend, now. That which one is all these things now? Like everybody, everybody suffering from ADHD normally. Which one can be all these ones now? That's yeah, not they difficult just, for everybody. Yeah, they update them, they, they update them every time. <laughs> the updating high of the up is not be like every every day that they update them because what 
But anyway, I feel like I really want to read. I've almost st- packed, stacked, stacked books by my bedside table just to ensure that I wake up to see them. I have books on my laptop. I have books on my phone. My dear, even the small course where I don't this one, I still never finish. I'm a little, I'm a little sad to say it, but like, just reading has been very stressful. If I, if I can't watch YouTube and probably get even the YouTube save pause and play one million times, but it just seems really difficult. I also say we will do accountability part now. How is that coming? Oh, me when I even register. Guess who's not living on my streets? Tell me. Popular our guy, person? our guy in the, the gym. The guy Which me one? and you both know. The one me and you oh both know now. Yes. Hey, Bobo. I've been uh-huh. seeing him a lot. I don't know this. Ah, this guy now. So the pressure is getting worse. It's getting Wessa. worse. Ah, worse. All those your street parties where they look you normally before now. They oh, know, we don't so get sorry, no, we don't get my area, we don't get your body. We don't get no, don't worry, don't bother. I've come the length and brent. I've come the length and brent of that place. There's nobody on my streets or in my area. Thank you. Now you know. You see, yes. no, no, say all these things they, they turn over just like water. Mm. Before you know it's now, mm. some bodies can just turn over into your your into your neighborhood. You know, go no because you feel you don't give up hope. Uh, we we'll go see. Keep your we go see. G. We we'll go see. <laughs> yeah. See. But it's been nice to have a trainer on the podcast. Let's talk about fitness for a bit because it's such a thing now. Yeah, everybody. Fitness and well. Sometimes I see videos yeah. of people in like the gym close to me. I'm like, wow, okay. You guys oh. keep doing it. Yeah. Sometimes I don't go on Instagram. Like, I just go on TikTok and I say, I know this particular branch now. I'm like, oh, mm-hmm. yeah, this is the one I go to. Oh, okay. You know that you see people are still, people are burning. Don't go again. Why you Oh, no. No, no, we are there in spirit now. As long as I paid, sorry. Mm-hmm. I, I, I did almost a year right. there, man. I made a countdown. Right. Crazy, man. In this economy. In this economy. Right. Yes, yeah, so. Right. It's easier for people to go and buy, to go and pay for NAX and go and pay for gym. I hope they know. So anybody you see enter no. the gym, please. Things are please. changing now. People, okay. people, so to be fair, people pay for the gym to get NAX. Oh, sorry. They pay, they pay. I pay for they, the gym to look good, though. I don't know about you. <laughs> well, fair point. Oh, I forgot to mention. I also worked the Access Bank. So oh, I, I saw that. I, I have to. I penciled that. So I penciled that in my diary as my reminder mm-hmm. that I must do the okay. marathon next year. Yes. Oh yeah. So yeah. this is my third time doing the marathon. I can all see. I you must do it too. Is it a full marathon? Is it a full twenty-five point six miles or the half ma- half marathon? I think the first leg, it, like the long one, is is it thirty six kilometers? Was it thirty six or forty two kilometers? I think the first leg is forty two, and then there's mm-hmm. a ten kilometers. Ten kilometers is on the island here. Um, yeah, so that's the half one, I, I guess. Well, let's not call it half. Just two races. They're just two different races, pretty much. Mm-hmm. Um, I've only done mm-hmm. the ten kilometers. I've never done anything more. Um, but this one was particularly interesting for me because I walked the full 10 kilometers alone. Shout and out I to didn't you. have any partner. See, first off, big shout out to Loose Talk because I just plugged in and I did the walk with a, a full episode and a half. Of oh. So I'll really just catch up with Loose Talk, I promise you. And it was so interesting for me. I was happy. I was like, oh, catching up with the guys. Um, and I did a lone walk from um, Lekki to BI. So was what was your good. time? Nine Bikoko, what was your time? Um, I think I did, I, I'm going to check it again to be sure, but I know I did like 15,000 steps. Yeah, obviously, um, you did that more, of course. No. Yeah, 15,000 plus steps. I think I did like almost two hours though, because it was really if a I, walk. I didn't if I, try, if, I, if I tried that, my legs would burn. No. Trust me, it's not so bad. I promise you that you would not even feel it. I, so one thing I've also come to like learn is that I do mundane things with things. I I, I I match mundane things with things that I like, right? So if I hate, I hate washing plates, for instance. Anybody who knows me knows this. I hate washing dishes, so I try to pair my washing of dishes with talking to someone on the phone or listening to music. Or you know, seeing a movie, something that I don't, I, I really enjoy doing. 
um just so that it takes my mind off that um trust me it, was not, it wasn't the worst thing but i was super proud of myself it felt like because again as i said i've been going through it i've just really been mentally struggling and i've been living through a lot of self-doubt and just accomplishing that that day uh when i reached the finish line i was saying eh first first i went to go and sit down first and just pour water on my head make i thank myself say ah which you tried you know but it was it was fun and shout out to all the people who came out um a lot of people in nigeria are really trying to keep fit and it was just great to see in different ways the cyclers the um the skateboarders um different guys really just out trying to trying to make this thing a community thing me i registered but i didn't get my tag i couldn't wait in fact i even got to, i got to the start line very late because no uber but then again it was great wow. Yeah, okay. it was a great time. That was nice. Yeah, that was nice. Thumbs up, thumbs down yeah. to 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 the, they put seven up banana and everything. They will no see seven up drink. Now only hot water they give us. Yeah, it's good. Now. Seven up. Up. You want to take soft drink? Ah, uh-uh, no healthy lifestyle, please. Sugar please. Now. We need sugar. We need sh- when you when they run when they run for school, they know they give you glucose. They will give you glu- uh, glucose now. Yeah, take glucose. Uh, and- Ah, your school, they were fresh. Oh. They gave you guys gluco- not glucose. Oh, in our school, they gave us uh, glucose now. Nah. Yeah, lick it, lick it. Yeah, 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 exactly. That, that was the ginger. I remember that when, we had, when we had glucose at home, one more, when nobody's looking, just scoop, put it to your mouth. I yeah, swear. Damn. Uh, See, no, 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 it was, it was a thing. It was yeah. really Sp- good. Speaking yeah. about the marathon, I hope you did not face the mm. heat that we are, fa- we are we, the whole world is facing right now. Huh. Now, one she na ah, my dear. I say, it reminds mommy can get hit rashes. Oh, so <laughs> for people who don't more. know, yeah, NIMET, mm-hmm. which is the Nigerian Meteorological Service mm. uh, that we have in Nigeria, put out an alert yesterday on Twitter <laughs> and said air temperatures hit 41 degrees centigrade over the north and 39 degrees centigrade mm. over the south with model projections indicating temperatures to remain high in the coming days. Implications, wow. dehydration. This could also cause fainting, chicken pox disease, measles, heat rash. Um, yeah. And the map is here. And the map is not looking sexy. The upper part of Nigeria is yellow, bright yellow, which is um, be aware, which is there. Huh? Then the, the southern yeah. part is red. Red yeah. and a little bit of orange. Which means be prepared, huh. and unfortunately, this has coincide, coincided with no electricity in the fucking Federal huh. Republic of Nigeria. People yeah. are running out of their minds. People are crying at night when they are sleeping because Listen. fuel is expensive, so you can't be putting fuel overnight, down on day. Nepal doesn't, or whichever disco you use, doesn't give up to four hours of light anymore. I can mm. bet you charge your power, leave your power bank at home, charge just put it in the in the, in the socket and just leave it, even though there's no light. When you come back, it has hardly charged. It will be like 25% or 30%. This is how little That's electricity we get. Yeah. And now if you check your phone, Android or Apple, you see weather alerts 35, 37 degrees centigrade, 38 degrees centigrade. Right. No wind, there's no breeze, no breeze is blowing at all, everywhere is stagnant. Or more. It's, this is the, the end of this they talk about. This is the end of this. Listen. Hmm. I don't know. I really don't know what's going on. But... Are you, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Continue. I really don't know what's going on. But it's really a mad thing happening in Lego. In fact, in Nigeria, my friends up north are complaining about the heat. Just now, now I thought some weeks ago it was Hamatan that we were. So we're yes, the it, is I think cool. the Hamatan what was covering for the heat. Once the Hamatan le- and the Hamatan did not even decrease, it just the next morning uh, pff, I'm I'm done. It just went. It you just get, went. Dropped it like a bad relationship. Ah, uh, and gave us the sun, the sun to deal with. See, eh? I said today, 
you know when they say your body is biting you it feels that was yes. literally it, it feels as if there's fire body. yeah it feels as if there's fire in the air and they're using it oh to roast God. burn you like bro it is ah. terrible ah see now you know you know that you know that thing that when Catholics go and take ash like this you don't want the thing to clean so you go they maintain yeah. your face so that you don't go sweat my dear I don't know the time where I use hand clean everything because eh, hmm. it was too hot. People are sweating buckets. People are sweating buckets. See, no, 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 no. It's not really. It's not. It's not even funny anymore. To be honest, yeah, so if really you know, really... if you know you have to go outside a lot, please be careful. Heat stroke is not funny. You can get stroke from heat, oh. Yeah. Do you understand? Pass out. Yeah. And pass I'm, out, even, I'm even like pitting like the, the babies, you know, two, three months See? old. Oh, yeah, exactly. there's no gen. The fan is be- uh-huh. the fan itself is heat, like the fan is generating heat. It's only AC that can you change this heat. And you hear babies crying you at night the- with heat rash. Yeah, it's very troubling. The, the AC the AC is struggling with is is struggling with the heat too. It, it yeah. almost now feels like Everybody needs to service their AC because um, AC the people don't blow. AC repairmen don't blow that. because they really, really I think you need those strong. You need those strong ACs, like industrial ACs, or those fans that mm-hmm. there's, there's a there's a there's like an, a, a a part of it those where you can pour water, where you can pour yeah, water, so it now cools it. Mm-hmm. That is the only thing mm-hmm. I can change mm-hmm. with this too. If you are using normal study fan, your study fan will melt. See. Your study fan, so will, ceiling fan has disappeared. Self, ceiling fan is gone. There's no bother with ceiling fan. Nobody buys that. Nobody buys ceiling fan anymore. It's I have a ceiling fan in my room. I don't feel it. I don't. I think this See? generation of ceiling fans are dead. Like of it's course. not like your grandmother's ceiling fan. That <laughs> if you sleep shirtless, you are waking up with malaria the next day. You, I swear down. You like, grung, grung, but that grung, the speed how that is moving. Oh lord. Oh lord. <laughs> This uh, hotel See, fans they have. Know. These hotel fans that we have, they don't play anything at all. Mm. They're not doing much. But first, first, before we even, we even jump into going with this conversation, is there light? No, yeah. there is no light. Do you get what I mean? Lights, no D. This is even the worst. On... This is worst I've ever seen in terms of electricity in Nigeria. That the whole nation Honestly. Has, doesn't have electricity. It's and so the reason, it's ba- the reason it's is. It's been a very difficult time. It's, it's not that, the reason it's funny, and it's not as if it's funny, funny, but because it is so. This has been like the worst electricity electricity blackout I've ever witnessed as a Nigerian, where See. every part of the country is complaining, every oh. single part. And our humble minister of power, uh, we'll talk about him later mm. in flop of the week, you know, said oh. that basically the federal government does not have money to buy, purchase gas for the to subsidize electricity companies to use. Uh-huh. Yeah. So now they are saying that they can't afford to pay the subsidy on electricity anymore, which is already you know they done the clap already it's from the clap now they're going to enter the ama piano dance they're going to enter the do, 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 our do, piano that's how they play this one. <laughs> our piano yes <laughs> and um, the IMF already came out with a report confirming that the federal government has started paying subsidy once again on petrol they huh. already confirmed that already. So I think the Tinubu government is just afraid now that um, if it is, we will subsidy in electricity. These people will shoot also. Uh, so this is where we are right now. The Minister of Power has given a press conference. He has not given up Nigerians a timeline of when the manageable electricity that we had uh-huh. will go back to that status. He hasn't given us. He's just telling us stories upon stories. But we'll get, we'll get, we'll get to him. So now when there's no electricity... Um, Fuel is, is an issue. Not everybody can, you know, power their generator. And now the heat, it feels like we are close to hellfire. As a matter of fact, people are saying on social media that, uh, please, if you know you open the, the gate of hellfire, please close it because this is getting too much. People are roasting out there. I'm, I'm going to work every single day now just because I want to enjoy AC. Not because of anything else. Skincare is not skincare right now because by the time um, you work... I let go... I had to put moisturizer on my face. I said, no. By the time I go outside, I'll melt. Oh, God. It's so, 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 so hot. Like, it, it is, is hot. incredulously hot in Lagos. 
if a white know. person comes to Lagos now, or more, you'll, you'll be black. Up. Forget tan. Obviously. You'll be black. You'll and you go like back home with skin cancer. You yeah. get skin cancer. There's no help. Yes, and to our friends with albinism, please just stay indoors because the normal like that's what was wicked. Now it is wicked. Mm. So please just stay indoors. I beg. Some care tips for this season. Try to actually drink more water. Wear some yes. appearance so that you don't kill the next person. The heat is already enough. Try to brush yeah. your teeth. Try to wear a face cap. Wear sunglasses mm -hmm. when necessary so that you don't have you don't have um um dotted spotted vision or dry eyes or stuff. Try to keep yourself mm -hmm. try to keep yourself um moisturized. So wear sunscreen, try to keep your skin healthy and and you know refreshed. But above all, have a bath, please. Make an and also bath. Yeah, make an adi bath because someone had the ooze. Ah, yeah, ooze. Not the ooze. Bath. Yeah. Eh? yeah. Also, if you can get a mobile fan, all those fan where women they use. This is not time to be forming a mobile fan now. The AC one. Yeah, hey, please, on poor. On poor, please. I am buying the fan now. This is not female. It is survivor fan. Because it is deadly out here. Oh, so interestingly, I really love it when people give very thoughtful gifts. So that wedding I That's a thoughtful gift. Yeah, that's do you get what I mean? That wedding I went for some like a week or two ago now. They gave us like these neck fans. At first, I was thinking, oh, why, why do we need these neck fans? Or more very important and has come in really handy. Like you can just put the thing around your neck, like um, like a headphone, like how you hang your headphone. Yeah, I know it's absolutely yeah. Exactly. They gave it to us or more, and they gave us hand fans as well. No, it has really saved my life in this time. It has mm. been hot so please Hello. if you can maintain body temperature and if you know how to swim this would be a great time to get in the water every now and then just to maintain body temperature um mm, yeah that's true but yeah most i checked the weather forecast mm -hmm. sorry i checked the weather forecast yesterday for mm -hmm. tomorrow which is obviously today you're listening and it says mm -hmm. there might be a little drizzle let's just pray it is not the rain that we bring more heat because that one day too. i tell you but I heard that it, it's not because me, I not see that's why I'm saying I heard. I heard that it drizzled a little yesterday morning. Oh, um, I don't feel I'm anywhere. Oh. I don't feel that drizzle anywhere at all. Ah, uh, okay. You, everybody, yeah. will, they will, everybody will be fine. But I think I just to double take on this sound warning, you guys, they bath, they bath. Pour water for body, bath, clean your body. Ah, no, there are some and buy kind perfume of... too, please. You know, if perfume, you know, things are expensive in the country right now, but like you don't need to buy the you're not buying a Versace, I'll be Tom Ford. The 2K51 self is okay, we'll manage it as long as it's please. It's and okay. I'm talking about this small a bit because we're struggling through a lot in this country, the country is already smelling. We don't want to smell any more than that, I beg. Mm -hmm. We are really just it managing the oxygen that we are receiving, I beg. Yeah, don't, I don't beg. Don't the issues. Thanks and God bless. Yes. Um. So there's another talking point, but I don't think we should really digress. Too much. We should speak, I mean, we should speak too much on it. It has to do with our former um, leader, which mm. I don't like seeing his name. Mm. Investigations have shown clearly that um, there, there's been a lot of mismanagement under his administration, mm. and we wonder what he was, what he actually knew during his time. Nothing. The latest investigation reveals that uh, his signature was forged, mm. and a certain amount of money was removed from the coffers of the CBN. Mm. It seems the more we go, me, I'm very happy, and you know why I'm happy because mm. this time last year, mm -hmm. a certain individual. Was tormenting the whole nation. A very, this man is not more than five feet something. Five five exactly. most. I like the fact now that they're opening the Yash in public uh -huh. to show that that prison you go stay now. You exactly. go stay now because clearly we are seeing the. How can the CBN be borrowing money to people? When yeah. did the CBN become a commercial bank? You get like I I I don't understand really. I don't understand. It's it's, it's really baffling at the end of the day. 
So, um, but yeah, that is an update on the president, former President Buhari, um, who we don't like speaking about because he had eight years and he did rubbish with it. And they okay. said they forged his signature. And I said, of course, they forged his signature because I'm sure Buhari's signature is B U H A R I dot. Uh -huh. That is it. There's no, it's not a fancy signature. It's B U H R I dot underline. Finish. Uh -huh. Anybody could have forged that shit. But anyway, um, yeah, let's go into prop of the week. Mm. Uh, I, I saw go to watching the finals. Uh, obviously, sorry, well, for what happened uh, <laughs> at the end of the day. I can't believe it. Super egos propose, man, dis uh, God disposes. That's all oh. we can say. No, super egos did not. Okay, let me not slander. They say we don't they give they them. Tried. They tried. Yes. They now, tried. See, now, now they bully will be will be when they cry now. Like, not take so, no, that yeah. it will be on first. That one, it just pack. Let's just pack in one side first, right? Not anything targeted but i know nothing about football right it's past yeah, yeah. um the small things that i've been told over time but from the beginning of that boy i know see all the pressure just there on our post side and i was like ah, um, why first why of all you're you playing the whole nation that's why because you're playing the whole nation it's not easy and i also <laughs> heard they didn't land nigerians to enter i heard that they were, they, they were selling tickets to nigerians a lot of nigerians could not enter the stadium that day so they 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 hampered on our emotional and they hampered yes, our emotional and physical support. May your fans know the chair on our own. May not know the yen in the may not know the yen in the parana. Actually, but anyway, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I'd like to give prop of the week to this young gentleman because mm -hmm. um, in football, a lot of Nigerians, a lot of Nigerians who could actually play for Nigeria mm -hmm. end up playing for other countries. Exactly. If you go to England, there are a lot of there are a lot of Nigerian ballers. People who were born of Nigerian parents were like, nope, we'll play for England or some other country. Well, yeah. let's appreciate these young men who came out, sacrificed their club careers, because uh -huh. right now their clubs are still playing on here. Uh -huh. uh -huh. And they came out to sacrifice their time, energy, exactly. their bodies to play for Nigeria. At the end of the day, they have to be a winner. Nigeria get to the silver. Mm -hmm. I didn't I, I did not even expect or imagine that Nigeria would get so far. But we did and we tried, you know. Mm -hmm. I believe that African countries just ganged up against us because they didn't like us. 53 African countries ganged up against Nigeria because they know what would have mm -hmm. happened if we if we won that tournament. And I go here when it's only really Ghana. Ghana, we don't want the we just they misbehave. We don't want to know their position. They they fuck up. Yeah. So shout out to the super goods of Nigeria. Hopefully, the next tournament in 2025 or 2024. Yeah. They will, they will go they will win the whole thing you know so Amen. We're going shout to out win to all of and nigeria yeah, that, that's good. nigerians remain undefeated even when we now yes, won so. us, even now when we lost <laughs> the, the, the the cup is not even fine see now i young call ah. so what is that some people said thank god i don't understand french you know go pay me i'm not true yeah i know that's not french when you hear i talk mm -hmm. <laughs> we don't care Nigerians have no shame, but trust me, oh, when Nigerians come back for you, if Nigerians oh, want to attack you, or more, you leave, you leave this continent for also. Last, oh, last. God. Anybody, all the three countries, they had the come out. Oh, when are they come out to go and this? Yes, because oh. we are mad people. You know, we are mad. No, <laughs> definitely undefeated, for sure, for sure. Yeah, definitely no. undefeated. Do you understand? Okay, before we wrap up, let's go to flop of the week. There's a certain gentleman who comes from my side of the country. Or your states, I don't know how he wrangled himself. He's a banker, but somehow he's not the minister of power. His name is Adebayo Adelabu. Um, unfortunately, his um, his tenure as a minister of power has coincided with the worst blackout we've seen in this country for in decades. And instead of giving Nigerians daily updates and a timeline of when we we'll get normalcy back, he keeps giving excuses and excuses and excuses, which is the trademark of Nigerian politicians who don't just give a fuck. And that is why this man deserves to be flop of the week. This man waited days where he was killing Nigerians for him to make a statement and say, oh, this is the situation. Oh, this is why power generation has reduced in the country. And today, on Valentine's Day, he, keeps, he kept giving excuses again. May this man not find love in Jesus' name. Ah, God, I you, not find, you, will, you will not find love. If he finds you find love, find, there's no way. Only the, only the love of Jesus Christ. But if you're looking for love, and no, he's not getting anything love. Because he's suffering millions of Nigerians with his inefficiency and like a difficult attitude towards a, a, a big problem like this. You know, I don't, 
I don't know why a banker should be to be heading power in this country, but this is Nigeria, where a water engineer, a minister of sports. So I've seen crazy things before. But this man already less than one year, F9. F9, you don't know what you are doing. And that's why Nigerians are begging for you to resign. Because clearly you are clueless. As only press conference you know how to do. The issue on ground now, instead of you to, to tackle it, you say you are creating a committee to look into it. Why are you creating a committee to look into something that you already know the problem of? This is the issue of Nigeria at the end of the day. And that's why we have a minister of power who is just doing falafolo and doing rubbish. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm. That's the full on rant. I respect it. Um, no, no, no catch on for streets. No, we no catch on for streets. <laughs> it will be real. It, it will be real, my nigga. That out, please. All that yeah. energy needed to be left out. Yeah, hundred percent. The power, the power situation will be better next week. Hopefully, if not, or more. Have to go buy. Have to go find generator. Go lakpo. Go buy. Go collect loan for generator or pampi. Ah, my go dear. Go loan. Don't no collect from the handle because. Now, so person called me some days ago. He said, Did they post in your obituary? Did they tell people, say, you don't die? I swear so much. Honestly, say, the girl was telling oh, me that well. they play putting out her pictures that like she's a dead person and she's a dubious person. Times, those were times for desperate measures. That's mad. Like That's that. really crazy. Do you understand? Yeah, it's really been extreme, to be honest. But, Too I mean, extreme. But in. We're in Nigeria. If you are not, if you go, if you go slack, oh, you understand. they go use you. Yeah, they go yeah. ride you. Bo, bo, Nigeria has they hear that one. On God. Yeah. Wow. I think it's a wrap. Thank you guys for listening to us. Um, yeah, we'll be back again next week. Um, we start with fan mail. <laughs> with fan mail and release therapy. After somebody has finished committing adultery, he will send in the uh, application. We will send in the needful. Thank you very much for listening to us. If you have fan mail or release therapy on this Valentine's Day's issue, let us know how your Valentine's Day went. Yes. Let us know whether yes. they gave you breakfast, lunch, or, or dinner. You, or you just or send you it to family. Yeah, or you saved it. Exactly. Send it to us at family at 234essential.com. Follow us also on every social media platform for increased engagement, um, exclusive content, and more, you know. Um, uh, what, what's the word? More visuals on 234. I, I follow us. Oh, which mistake I don't go do that. We get, we, we understand. We get the idea. Follow us on every social media platform at 234 essential podcast.com. See, yes, I don't say dot com. I, I swear, don't to God, worry. I, you're like the you're like NSDC man. Don't worry. Idea, idea is neat. Idea is uh, neat. No, I was actually, see, I was actually almost sleeping off right now because it's been such a long Bele. day. Person don't even tire. Yeah. And big shout All out right. to Tersi. Tersi says she sent us fan mail and she really wanted mm -hmm. us to take a deep dive into that. But oh, read it, don't worry. Uh, don't worry. Tell us you read it. Now. Don't worry. That'll be a problem. That's yeah. a problem. Yes, yes. All yes. right. Thank you guys. Be, be kind. Yeah. Be kind, everyone. Peace out. <laughs>